Welcome to Legacy Week GX Edition, a week where I will be revisiting six of Yu-Gi-Oh! GX most epic sets released between the years 2006 to 2008. Each day I will open one of these epic sets, starting with Shadow of Infinity and ending with Light of Destruction and a first edition blister pack. Every day I will also include a giveaway with some epic cards. Which set has what it takes to earn the title of Legacy Week GX Champion? You will just have to watch to find out. What's up guys, we're back with day two of Legacy Week GX Edition. And after day one, I mean, oh my goodness, it's gonna be hard to follow that up. That was insane. Well, let's just start off, we have a giveaway. I'll be giving away these two cards, Desert Twister and a secret rare from Tactical Evolution, Abyssal King Shark. So I, this is one you don't see very often, so kind of an interestingly rare card. So just like the video, be subscribed, turn on notifications, let me know down below what will be the best opening for Legacy Week GX Edition. I have a feeling I know what you're gonna say, but there's some good stuff coming up, including, I know the Light of Destruction does have a first ed blister involved, but that one is, it sort of counts because, you know, the other ones didn't first ed, but maybe you could throw that into your vote. Today, we will be opening some Duelist Pack Jade and Yuki. This is a set I've not opened a ton up. There are a few more packs in this one, but Duelist Pack usually doesn't have as much value inside. So just to make it a little bit fair, I think they have about 21 packs and that's just the amount I had. So it kind of evens out pretty well. Uh, I will be opening some uh, Zane. I think is it Zane or Chaz? No, Chaz. We have some Duelist Pack Chaz that'll be thrown in with Phantom Darkness and then a couple packs to even it out for, I think, uh, the glass only had 16. So there's a couple going to be in there. So then just to make sure everybody has a similar amount of packs. But let's get into this. I do not know a ton about this set. Usually these Duelist Packs have like one ultra rare. So I didn't look it up just to be a little bit more surprised. I think the Elemental Hero Flame Wingman's in here as a super. But there's a lot of Jaden packs. So I'm always a little confused about you know, which one's which and if it counts or whatever. So, uh, or which one came in what? Because I think there's three different Jade Impacts. We have Bubble Shuffle. Wait, let's see what this says. We have the Duelist Pack. Want to play like the rest or duel like the best? Learn how to play online at www.yugio-card.com. Play your cards right now in League of Tournaments. Challenge other duelists or just build your skills. Visit www.wantaduel.com to find a place to duel near you. Does that still work, by the way? Uh, editor, look that up and, and then put it on the screen. See if it still works. So get Get your game on very cool and then this says strategy card six so from dark beginning to dark beginning to interesting not legacy of darkness dark beginning too so i guess it's more accessible at that point elemental hero monsters make great choices for a warrior deck as you can see with the warrior returning alive which can be found in jaden yuki's duelist pack so i guess we can see that support your elemental heroes with strategic monsters like exiled force or mystic swordsman level two i love mystic swordsman level two and use reinforcement of the army to search them out of your deck honestly a pretty good tip i mean warriors were pretty good back then doing that searching those out so very cool uh, Bubble Man right off the bat. Speaking of warriors, you could search, probably wouldn't, but uh, Wing Karibo, unless you only have no, no cards in your hand, you might want a special for draw two or whatever. Okay, uh, Wing Karibo, that's a rare, our first rare of the set, or of the opening, and then Sparkman, and then Dark Catapults. I wonder if we can pull the full set in today's video, because I think there's only 30-ish cards in these normally. I don't know, we'll have to try and see if we can we can do it. All right, first Ed Jane Yuki. If we can, then maybe uh, maybe I can put the full set up for sale on my website, because we are gonna have Rarity Collection one up there, and we're, along with Rarity Collection two, which I still have some Rarity Collection two full sets, because you know we opened a lot of the sets. So if you do want a full set, like super rare, ultra rare, or uh, secret rare, they're available on ruxin34.com right now. Here's the checklist. So honestly, I might use this to try to complete the set later. Uh, I'm gonna put the checklist aside. I'm not gonna look at the spoilers. We have Avian, Transcendent Wings to go with our Wing Karibo, Skyscraper, another rare, and Elemental Hero Sparkman. Oh, and there's the Warrior Returning Alive, which you might wanna use with your Elemental Hero cards, as they said on the tip card. Very nice, looking good. First edition packs. Can we get some foils? The question is though, if we get some gradable foils, it's like Elemental Hero playing Wingman, we might need to grade that, you know? That might be kinda cool. All right, we have another tip card, Elemental Hero Defense. Elemental Hero monsters are powerful attackers when combined with the strength of Skyscraper, but when they are defending, they become vulnerable to, due to their low attack. You could protect them with defensive cards like Draining Shield or Negate Attack, and you should also try Sword of revealing light or enemy control. All right, we have Bubble Man. Burst in tricks, double elemental hero. Bubble Blaster, there we go. Okay, yeah, I have this in a PSA 10 as well, so. Spark Blaster, oh no! This last card got bent. Fortunately, the Bubble Blaster didn't. It seems like it's honestly gradable. We might have to sleep this sucker up. All right, Bubble Blaster, first edition. This is some of the only first edition packs we're opening in this legacy week because, you know, I just didn't have first edition packs for the most part, but Jay and Yuki, we did. We did have first sets. So hopefully we can keep pulling all the supers because I think it's mostly the support cards like uh, Spark Blaster. I don't think that's a hollow though. There's the Clay, clay Charge. Clay Charge, maybe the Burstinatrix one. There's a Fusion Gate. We have, we're not going to read every card. We have uh, Transcendent Wings, Rottweiler. Oh, the steam heal. That's the ultra rare. I, why does this not look like an ultra? 
Does this look like really subtle? Look how subtle the foil is. It's kind of beautiful, actually. Dark catapults are an element zero clay, man. The steam healer has been pulled. Ultra rare. Centering on it looks good. It looks clean. This thing might be a PSA 10. Okay, maybe a little bit of scuffing on the back. Like very minimal. That thing has a chance. So beautiful steam healer. That's a really cool card. What is this? Percinatrix and Bubble Man put together. Steam healer, I feel like, is doesn't get remembered like a lot of the other ones do. Honestly, we are having such a great Legacy Week GX edition so far. I mean, oh my goodness. The polls have been absolutely wild. Absolutely wild. Uh, we will have a playlist at the end of the video that that links to the full Legacy Week GX edition. I'll probably have the original, I mean, not original Legacy Week, but our last Legacy Week doing like, uh, you know, the regular GX dual monsters kind of openings. We have AB and we have Bubble Man. Let's see what we can pull. Negate attack. Speaking of negate attack, they brought it up earlier. Feather shot and elemental hero clay man. A lot of elemental heroes in here, which is really cool. Because, you know, elemental heroes are uh, fan favorites for sure. So pulling as many of those as possible is great. We have, oh, strategy car nine with called haunted. These are actually decent. I mean, for as a kid, I feel like that would help. Uh, bubble shuffle. We have draining shield. Wing Karibo. Again, another rare. Uh, hero emerges and... Elemental Hero Clay, man. A lot of packs left, still a lot of chances. I mean, I think there's probably like three or four supers in the set, along with one Ultra. If it's like a 30 card set, it looks like there are 30 cards according to that tip card. So 30 total cards. We may be able to complete the set. We just need to pull all the foils, which is going to be tough. That's, that'll definitely be the hardest part. Fusion Sage, because, you know, you might get repeats. You might not get all of them, et cetera, et cetera. Uh, burst Center Tricks. Yeah, speaking of getting all of them, the Clay Charge. Let's go. Okay, I thought that was scuffing, but it's just him punching. Like, it's it's the movement of his fist through the air. Okay, we have a uh, Feather Shot and a Clay Man. So Clay Man to go along with Clay Charge. Let's see what this one looks like. Centering looks pretty good. Back looks pretty good. Okay, we might have some... Some cards to be graded. That is really nice. Okay, not like huge value cards, but PSA 10s, I mean, Elemental Heroes, it's not going to be bad. And we are only a few packs in. Legacy Week GX has been crushing, absolutely crushing. I'm just waiting for the video where we pull like zero foils, but hopefully it doesn't happen. Maybe we'll just keep pulling amazing like we have been. It's going to be hard to compete against yesterday, but I mean, we're doing our best out of a uh, Jay Yuki pack. We have a uh, Transcendent Wings, Elemental Hero Avion. Wing Karibo level 10 is in here. Okay, new rare. All right, Sparkman and the Warrior returning alive. Very cool. Okay, guys, I've decided we're doing the checklist right now. Let's see. I'm going to go through what we have. I'm going to check it off on this checklist, and then we're going to come back and see what we need. All right, I went through the checklist. This is what we have so far. I accidentally marked off polymerization. We don't have that, but the rest we have. So we don't have Flame Wing Man Super. We don't have a rare Thunder Giant. We don't have a rare Rampart Blaster. Polymerization Common. Burst Return is apparently a super. Bubble Illusions and Ultra. I forgot about that. So there are two Ultras in here. Then I'm missing Hero Signal and Featherwind. So that's a common and a rare. So we've got a bunch of cards left that we need to pull. And that was kind of fun to go through and try to get the full set. And we're just gonna just gonna keep going. So oh wait, I put them in order. So here are all the here's the order, but I didn't put the supers in there because in the ultras, because you know they look really nice. I don't want to scratch them up or anything. So okay, let's see what we can get for the rest of the set. This is kind of fun actually having the, the checklist. Let's see what else we can get. We need polymerization. Draining shit. Wait, do we need that? What are the two supers we need or the commons we need? No, we have draining shield. We need hero signal and polymerization. Okay. Hero signal. Let's go. There it is. Rampart blaster. We need that. Okay. Hey, Polly. What a pack. Spark blaster. Okay. I think we, did we have that? I think we did. Oh my goodness. We just knocked off a lot. That was like a, it would like move to the right spot where we didn't have all the cards on. I don't know if they do sheets or whatever, but it felt like all those cards we didn't have were in the same, well, they were all in the same pack. So it's kind of interesting. All right. Updated card. We now need a super, a rare, a super, an ultra, and a rare. So it's all, it's, we don't need any more commons. We've gotten everything when it comes to commons. We need that bubble illusion. That's going to be one of the hardest ones because it's the ultra rare. So we already have one ultra. Steam Healer is probably the better one, honestly, but if we can get both, it'd be great. Strategy card number three, we have Hero Signal, Rottweiler, Bubble Blaster again. So a repeat on the Super is not going to help us complete our set, but Bubble Blaster is a really cool one. So I'll take that, sleep it up. Looks very, very clean, potentially gradable again. Awesome. These foils are really good. All right. Still a lot of packs left. Still a lot of potential. We are getting, I mean, there's a rare in every pack. So the rares we need hopefully will show up. The Supers and Ultras, on the other hand, not necessarily. We have uh, Strategy card number two. We have Avian. Bubble Shuffle. Featherwind. We need this one. Okay, Featherwind. We can mark that off. Dark Catapulter. And the Warrior Returning Alive. So more comments. Featherwind. We can not, uh, mark this off. I cannot speak. So that, that clears out that section at the bottom, leaving us with one, two, 
three, four cards left and we're done. Four cards. Can we get four cards in the last eight to 10 packs here? I think we can do it. I think we can do it. Let's make it happen. Here we go. Strategy card of Rottweiler. It's always going to be the third slot bubble shuffle. Burst return. Yes, I thought it was another bubble blaster for a second. Hero emerges in Polly. That is another super that we need. Let's go. Back looks amazing. These cards look really, really good. I, it feels weird that it's like burst in tricks all red and then it's like spell cards. So it's just green around it. I don't know. It just feels wrong. All right. We're down to bubble illusion ultra. We need a super and a rare. So we need the elements of a flaming man and a rare. So we literally need rare super ultra one of each. <sighs> Let's go. We got this. We can do this. We're going to pull something crazy. Bubble Illusion, I'm going to feel really good about potentially. If we, we, we get everything but the Flame Wing, man, that'd be sad. Uh, Versinatrix, Fusion Sage. Uh, maybe it's Fusion. Get Rampart Blaster, that's a repeat. Okay, okay, okay. We still got three, six, eight packs left. Still a lot of chance. We only need three different cards. We can do this. We Can, do, can we complete the full set in only 20 or tw was it 21 packs, 20 packs, something like that? I think we can do it. We have the heart of the underdog. You gotta have the heart of the underdog. Joey Wheeler, bring out your cards. Even though it's Jay and Yuki, here we go. Burr, feather wind. Okay, spark blaster. All right, keep it going. Jay and Yuki, we got this. We got this. All right. Blind Comic Care, we have Elements or Bubble Man. Rottweiler, negate attack, dang it. All right, Palmer. I need to do a pack trick, so it's the last card. Six cards left, six packs left. Legacy Week GX Edition. It's been off to a great start. I mean, start off Shadow Infinity. I mean, you guys, if you didn't see what happened there, make sure to check out, check out, uh, not game one. <laughs> this is not the NBA Finals. Check out uh, the first video. In this one, if we could complete the set, it'd be pretty epic. We have Spark Blaster, we have uh, Dark Catapult, or a good way to follow it up. Bubble Man, Draining Shield, here we go. Thunder Giant, that's one of the rares we need. Thunder Giant, oh my goodness, we're down to two. It's coming down to the last second. Here we go, guys, it's down to two. We need Flame Wing Man, we need Bubble Illusion, and we have completed the full set in one opening. Five packs left. Let's do this, guys. Let's pull Elements or Flame Wing Man and the Bubble Illusion. Let's do this. We can do it. Come on. Two from the back. Let's go. Let's get the let's get that out of the way. We can do it like this. All right, let's see. Heart of the underdog again. Strategy card number one. Do we have all the strategy cards? How many are there? Does it say on here? Probably nine or ten or something. Uh feather shot. We have clay man, bubble shuffle. Bubble Man and give us Bubble Illusion or the Elemental Hero Flame Wingman. Let's go. Oh my goodness. This is crazy. This is like the worst condition one of all of them, of course. Centering's not terrible, but there are some a little bit of print lines. I mean, it's still pretty good. Definitely near mint plus. Okay, guys, that one checks off second to last, leaving us with one card left. Bubble Illusion, the ultra rare, the second ultra rare. So if we can pull two ultra rares and not be repeats, we can finish the set. All right, I took a look and I think we have all the strategy cards unless it goes to 10 because we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So we literally have the full set of everything, including the strategy cards, minus the ultra rare. That's all we need to pull to have completed Jaden Yuki one. Just be completely done with it. Four packs left. Bubble illusion. Come on. Make your appearance right here. Okay, another strat, another checklist. It's our first checklist we've had since the beginning. That's pretty cool. So a untainted one by, uh, you know, all the stuff we've written on it. Rot one, no, 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 two from the back. We gotta get Bubble Illusion in the last card. Okay, last card. We have Hero Emerges, Spark Blaster, Rottweiler, Draining Shield, and Skyscraper. I think Bubble Illusion, is it a, I'm trying to remember, is it a, is it a monster card? No, it's a spell, I think. It's a spell, right? It has that penguin looking dude on it. Okay, three packs left. It's getting a little intense here, guys. This is coming down on the wire. I didn't think that this Jaden uh, video would be so fun. Honestly, it's turned into a lot more fun than I was expecting. Maybe we'll have to do this for more Duelist pack openings. All right, so strategy card, we have all of those. Set that to the side. Two from the back, here we go. Polymerization, we have Spark Blaster, Draining Shield, Elemental Hero Avian and Winged Karibo. Really bringing out the suspense. Can we get last pack magic here? Duelist pack Jaden Yuki. Okay, okay, we gotta focus in. We gotta, gotta lean forward, everybody. Get serious. All right, there's the strategy card. Give us the big ultra. Here we go. Spark Man, Clay Man, Element, or no, Hero Signal. We have uh, Fusion Sage. 
and Wing Karibo. I mean, Wing Karibo is a great one, but there's one card we need in that last pack. Coming down to the wire, the final pack, we need one more card to complete the full set. We have all the strategy cards. We have the uh, complete checklist. We have all the cards. We just need one ultra rare out of Jaden Yuki first edition pack. If you guys have enjoyed Legacy Week GX, don't forget to subscribe because we have three more days coming up. Day one and two have been pretty insane so far. So make sure you subscribe for that. And don't forget to check out Ruxin34.com if you want to support the channel. And don't forget to check out Patreon because we are doing one Patreon only video a month. I mean, that's going to be coming out very soon for the Patreon. So keep an eye out for that. Here we go. Next pack. Last pack. Good luck, everybody. And by everybody, I mean me and everybody watching. We have strategy. Let's get some strategy right here for a last pack magic. We have Elemental Hero Spark Man, Spark Blaster, Rottweiler, Transcendent Wings. Please, Bubble Illusion, appear to us. Finish the set. Here we go. Negate attack. Our attack has been negated. That's all right. It turned into a pretty amazing opening where we just fell one short of completing the full set of Jaden Yuki. So maybe we'll get that bubble illusion at some point. This has been fun. Don't forget to check out Legacy Week coming up for the next three days as well. And I've got some other big videos planned after that. And we got new sets coming out next week. So I'm very excited. A lot of cool stuff coming up. So don't forget to subscribe. Shout out to Toll Info Show, Ernesto Deanna, America Deutscher, KK Beats, Brandon Chaney, Ian Musa, Junior Barding, Robert F. Cheng Lang, and Adelso Garcia Jr. Thank you guys for supporting the channel. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.